in 1972, when I was lucky enough to start teaching here, I started a course on innovating in healthcare. I thought this school was a perfect school to create the kinds of innovators who would make a lasting impact on healthcare. So I gave it a shot. That was a risk. I didn't know that the students would be interested at that time. The founding of the healthcare initiative was just pivotal in changing the environment around healthcare in the school. The enrollment grew. We now have physicians in every class. We have students who come from health insurance. We have people who come from the great technology. We had none of those people at that time. So I have two strings. One is the policy, one is the management, and I'll pull whatever string I can to make these things happen. These things being a more consumer-focused industry, which is better, cheaper, more accessible, and that has the transparency that people need so they can be intelligent when they're using the healthcare system. Reggie's importance to this faculty is massive. She has had an impact on, on the lives of so many practitioners in this area, and she continues to find ways to connect her current students to those existing leaders in healthcare delivery. I took my first position based on her involved with the company, and since then I've consistently thought Professor Herzinger's advice when I've had a career decision to make, and I found it very helpful. I stay in touch with the healthcare community, and I do it worldwide. And so I get to know a lot of people. She always had amazing guests, and so we were always super excited to know who are we going to meet and what story are we going to hear from them. So I have quite a big contact list. That contact list completely open to my students. If I have the contact, I will enable them to, to reach it. Professor Herzlinger's ideas have had a big impact on me. Her perspectives on thinking about the patient or the consumer as a key stakeholder in their own healthcare journey has been part of how I've approached uh, looking for technologies and, and built this current one. I wrote a book called Market Driven Healthcare, which initially had a response like, oh, she's just a horrible capitalist. She's going to ruin the healthcare. But the point of the book was that healthcare was not sufficiently oriented toward its consumers. Ultimately, market-driven healthcare became a best-selling book and won a number of awards. And I followed it up with other books. So I'm very proud of my students. Students are amazing, and they've done amazing things. It's really thrilling to see the transformation that this school enables.